hello friends in this part of vb6 tutorial i will show you how to use progress bars in vb forms so first of all you have to include that component so right click on uh, toolbar and click on components and search for windows common controls 6.0 and include it to your library now you can find progress bar here uh, there are multiple properties of a uh, progress bar the max length name I will short it as PB1 and uh, style scrolling style also it is smooth and standard smooth is like this and we can also change effects from 3D to 2D 2D is much better in feel. Now we have to use a timer here and a command button to enable and disable timer. Now in timer one control we have to use pv1 dot value equal to pv1 dot value plus one. it is simple increment function now in command button just use conditions if timer1 dot enable equal to false then just enable it timer1 dot disable and in else if it is disabled then enable it enable equal to false and now let me use ok first of all you have to set interval of timer control here so just I will putting 20 20 microseconds oh milliseconds oh I forgot to include end if here so just include end if now let me resume it it is working perfectly fine and as you can see uh, at max value I mean at 100 it is giving an, an error so I can put a condition here if pv1 dot value equal to pv1 dot max then uh, then just uh, exit or you can also set uh, if you can also include a button for uh, re uh, reloading the progress bar if at any time so you have to just include a code pb1 dot value equal to zero it is initial value so let me show you the execution now if I relo click to reload it again uh, reload the function that's it thank you for watching tutorial